Solomon peace be upon him God gave Solomon great kingship as never given to anyone before and will not give to anyone after him until the day of resurrection God gave Solomon knowledge and wisdom and taught the language of the birds and the animals and gave power over jinn and winds as well Solomon has the ability to imprison the jinn who did not obey his command and but tormented them in chains they were listening to his commands they built for him palaces statues that permissible in the religion and drive for him in the deep seas and bring the corals rubies and pearls and god gave solomon power over the wind and blew by his command and he was using it in main wars and among the blessing upon him was the army of solomon which consists of birds humans and jinn and solomon knew all the languages of each of those groups one day solomon ordered his army to be ready and then went out to review the army and check it and discovered the hoopoo absent and delayed to be ready with army solomon became angry and decided to torment of kill the hoopoo unless it has powerful excuse that prevented it from attending after some time the hoopoo came and said i came with certain news from saba city in yemen i found a woman ruling them god has given her power and kingship but the devil misled them and made them to worship the sun and stop worshiping the god after salman listened to hupu wrote a message and gave to hupu to carry it for saba and her people salman ordered in his letter to saba and her people to come to him as muslims the queen presented the message to the leader of her people whom she was consulting them on all matters they talked to her about the powerful salman army and difficulty to defeat it and made her to understand that she should go to him and listen to him the queen prepared herself and started the journey when solomon knew that the queen in her way to him he asked those who were around him if someone could bring the throne of saba before the queen reached his kingdom one of the jinn said i can bring the throne before the council ends but and other one said i can bring the throne in the time when the eye blinks the throne reached solomon solomon thanked god who tested him with his mighty power to see whether he thanks or disbelieve then ordered some amendments to be made on the throne to test seba and see whether she knows her throne or not when seba came and solomon accompanied her to the throne and looked at it and saw it completely like her throne but it's not her throne and she knew that this is her throne then saba realized this is her throne it preceded her to come she impressed by what she saw of solomon fat his prayers to god as impressed by what saw from advance in arts science and industries god liked saba heart with the light of islam after many years solomon died the jinn did not know that the solomon died and they kept working for him what they were usually doing Solomon was leaning on his staff the jinn saw him and thought that he is praying and continued their work long days passed when god sent the creatures crawl out of the ground and gnaw at solomon's staff until his body collapsed to the ground and gnaw at solomon's staff until his body collapsed to the ground the jinn knew that solomon was dead and they knew they are known the unseen and people knew the truth that did not know قال يا ايها الملا ايكم ياتيني بعرشها قبل ان ياتوني مسلمين قال عفريت من الجن انا اتيك به قبل ان تقوم من مقامك واني عليه لقوي امين قال الذي عنده علم من الكتاب انا اتيك به قبل ان يرتد اليك طرفك 
فلما رآه مستقرا عنده قال هذا من فضل ربي قال هذا من فضل ربي ليبلوني أأشكر أم أكفر ومن شكر فإنما يشكر لنفسه ومن كفر فإن ربي غني كريم In the ancient time there was an infidel king who ordered the people of his city to worship idols. One day, one of the youth believers invited towards the oneness of the God to worship God alone. This young man worked with his fellows from the city and preached the monotheism and invited people to have faith and believe in one God. So they believed in God and applied the teachings and the rules on themselves. These believers young men became famous then fidel king got informed about them that they left your religion and they mocked the idols you are worshiping the king called those young men to his council and ordered them to leave their religion and he threatened them with death if they don't do it the king gave them time to think before implementing this threat and sent them back to their homes إنهم فتية آمنوا بربهم وزدناهم هدى وربطنا على قلوبهم إذ قاموا فقالوا ربنا رب السماوات والأرض لن ندعو من دونه إلها لقد قلنا إذا شططا The young men consulted with each other to escape with their religion. Then they decided to enter into a cave that they already known about and they were followed by a dog that belonged to one of them. The young men have faith in God and were sure that God will protect them. They offered supplications and depended on God. They continued their journey till they reached at the cave. and just only few moments before they slept on the ground deep asleep without closing their eyes the days and nights and years passed after a year and they were lying asleep the sun was rising it did not befall them but as honor for them if the sun rises from the right side of their lind and if the sun set past from the north side did not befall them in the beginning of the day or at end provided them with only little of its rays not changed their colors and clothes if someone look at them he would think that they are awake while they were asleep because their eyes were open they were hidden from people god protected them from people sight if someone looked at them would have fled them from terror وَتَرَى الشَّمْسَ إِذَا طَلَعَتْ تَزَاوَرُ عَن كَهْفِهِمْ ذَاتَ الْيَمِينِ وَإِذَا قَرَبَتْ تَقْرِضُهُمْ ذَاتَ الشِّمَالِ وَهُمْ فِي فَجْوَةٍ مِّنْ ذَلِكَ مِنْ آيَاتِ اللَّهِ مَنْ يَهْدِ اللَّهُ فَهُوَ الْمُهْتَدِ وَمَنْ يُضْلِلْ فَلَنْ تَجِدَ لَهُ وَلِيًّا مُرْشِدًا When 309 years passed since they were asleep in the cave, God resurrected them from asleep and they barely hold themselves from hunger. And they wondered about themselves. How much time we have stayed here? One of them said, We stayed one day or some. Another one said, Only God knows how much time we stayed. We have to send one of us to buy us food. He should be careful and smart in order not to be known by anyone and to be followed by him and come to us and tell to the king and his people and let them know our place and torture and recant our faith. The king of that city was died and a believer and righteous king took over the city. And at that time, one of the people of the cave went to the city to buy food. 
he was wondered from the change of monuments and buildings. While buying food, when he took out his dirhams and gave it to the merchant, he was surprised to see the image of the infidel king who died 300 years ago. Then people gathered around him and took him to believe a king who has heard about them from his grandfather and asked him his history. He told him in detail that what happened to them. The king was pleased with that as people of his village have spread doubts about the resurrection after death and said to his people, Perhaps God has sent a sign to prove for you resurrection after death. The king walked with the people of the city. They were accompanied by the young man. When they reached near the cave, he said to them, I'll go inside alone so that they would not be terrified. He went inside the cave and assured them that infidel king is died and the current king is a believer and righteous. They were pleased with that and came out to the king, greeted him and king greeted them back and they returned to the cave. After proving the miracle of the resurrection of the dead and the hearts of the village people assured that the power and ability of the Almighty God to resurrect who died by living concrete example in front of them. God took the lives of the young men. Each soul has lifetime and must die. The people of the village differed. Some of them suggested to build monument on their cave. Some of them suggested to build a mosque. And the second group's suggestion was accepted. وَكَذَلِكَ بَعَثْنَاهُمْ لِيَتَسَاءَلُوا بَيْنَهُمْ قَالَ قَائِلٌ مِّنْهُمْ كَمْ لَبِثْتُمْ قَالُوا لَبِثْنَا يَوْمًا أَوْ بَعْضَ يَوْمٍ قَالُوا رَبُّكُمْ أَعْلَمُ بِمَا لَبِثْتُمْ فَبَعَثُوا أَحَدَكُمْ بِوَرِقِكُمْ هَذِهِ إِلَى الْمَدِينَةِ فَلْيَنْظُرْ أَيُّهَا أَزْكَى طَعَامًا فَلْيَأْتِكُمْ بِرِزْقٍ مِّنْهُ وَلْيَتَنَطَّفْ وَلَا يُشْعَرَنَّ بِكُمْ أَحَدًا إِنَّهُمْ إِنْ يَظْهَرُوا عَلَيْكُمْ يَرْجُمُوكُمْ أَوْ يُعِيدُوكُمْ فِي مِلَّتِهِمْ وَلَنْ تُفْلِحُوا إِذًا أَبَدًا